Uh, I'm Captain Brandon Wilkins. I'm the skipper of Sea Scout Ship 243 in South Portland, Maine. I'm Lawson Rindell, and I'm the bosun's mate. Same ship, same place. Okay. Um, and of course, you know, Sea Scouts is uh, a part of the Boy Scouts of America, but we're a regular scout troop who goes, you know, camping and hiking, climbing mountains. We're teaching seamanship skills, navigation, water safety, uh, and we go to sea. So instead of pitching a tent, we're more talking about. Exactly. Um, and it's a, a great exposure uh, to a, a part of the world that, that a lot of kids are not getting uh, to see. Uh, our, their connection with the ocean is uh, disappearing and it's impacting all sorts of aspects from the professional maritime uh, jobs, our working waterfront, um, and our military, the Navy, uh, the Coast Guard, and it's a great place for the scouts to see that side of the world. I agree, and especially in New Hampshire. The coastline is quite a bit smaller, so there is <laughs> definitely less opportunities to be on the water and experience what we're doing now. And you know, some of the things that we do is, uh, you know, we, we during the boating season we're underway just about every week. You know, when we're underway, it's uh, it's the youth's boat to run. You know, the adults are there to guide and mentor, make sure everything's safe. But um, we're not taking kids on a boat route ride. I, I would agree. You guys definitely have taken an easy way to show that you are there for us but not taking control um one of the things i like about it most is that we are the ones on a boat and we're the ones making sure that it's moving from place to place all you really do is make sure we aren't going to hit anything or you know catch the whole world on fire but um <laughs> you're usually just there sitting watching and drinking coffee um and i, and I really enjoy that part too and of course, there's the uh, long cruise um, every summer. Every summer. It's definitely an experience to go on a week out into some towns. You realize how small a 45 foot boat can be with, <laughs> well, we had 12 people last time. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, it, it, tensions did go high, not last summer, but the year before. <laughs> and it, it is. A wonderful experience but there is definitely a learning curve to each other yep and that's part of the learning experience and the leadership skills that we teach you yeah um, the <laughs> going back to the long cruise the favorite part for me was going through the Hell's Gate um, it's an extremely fast-moving current that goes through a very very small channel and it's definitely can be nerve-wracking for the first time if you go through. Mm -hmm. uh, but again, you're right there to make sure we don't smack against any rocks. And it can be very fun because the boat can drift a little bit easier than normal. Um, so it's definitely an experience. Well, that's why we teach it to <laughs> send you there and make sure you're behind the wheel while we're doing it.